Hello everyone, welcome to the Geekdom, the place where we outcast come to talk about the things we love, and today we're back talking about Deadpool and Wolverine. Now I finally watched the movie, it was amazing, I saw the midnight showing the day it came out, so, so good, I really enjoyed it personally, a lot of great stuff to come from it, but my favourite thing of the whole film was probably the Wolverine suit. Now, as I said in my last Deadpool and Wolverine video, there will be another video where I do the masked version of Wolverine, and... I just needed to see the film first, so I could make it as accurate as possible. So here we are, this is my battle damaged, sleeveless, full masked Wolverine. I love it. I love it so much, I think it's better than my other one, by far. It looks so, so good. We're gonna go top to bottom, as per usual. He's got a brand new molded mask piece. Um, mostly it's got that classic Wolverine look, those big fins. Um, the eye holes, obviously, and it's in that really nice yellow colour as well. It's not as big or as bulky as the one that we've been getting recently from LEGO. It's more angular, more closed on Wolverine's face, which I think looks really good. Um, he's got the sort of angry expression underneath because, uh, spoilers, this is the scene where he fights all of the Deadpool variants. Um, so he's, he's very angry and he's, he's killing a lot of people, so I had to give him a really angry expression. Moving down the torso. It's so beautiful. I'm so pleased. It looks so good. Right. One thing I have to say is, just like in my Invincible video, Lego would never put the blood on here. But I've put it on there because accuracy is key. He's got blood spackled all over his torso. He's killing loads of people. He's bleeding himself, right? There's gonna be blood. So there's lots of blood just kind of splattered all over the torso. He's got those big um, claw cuts from where like, um, Deadpool's like stabbed him and stuff at the start of the film. Uh, he's got bullet holes just dotted around his, his chest, um, obviously. And the suit itself, I've tr done, I've made such an effort to make it look really dirty. Um, and I think that's that's done really well. All the different shades of yellow and brown and black and stuff, it all comes really well to make this sort of grimy, dirty look, which looks really, really nice. All of that texturing is continued onto the legs and onto the hips as well. Those are pretty much exactly the same. Most of the parts on the hips and legs, they're exactly the same as my previous videos Wolverine, but they have got like that, that really nice dirty, that really nice dirty texture to them, which looks really, really great. The arms are different. They've got the same wrist braces. Um, once again, dirtied up, just like the rest of the costume, but he no longer has his sleeves. So he's just kind of got like a dirty skin tone and then he's got um, the shredded cloth of his uh, other costume where like the, the sleeves have been ripped off and the shoulder armor has been ripped off. And I just think it makes for such a really clean look. Such, such a cool suit. Obviously, he's got his chrome claws as well, which looks really, really great. And yeah, that's it. It's just a one-figure video. But I'm super, super pleased with how this came out. I'm a big fan of this look. Once again, highlight of the movie. Had to make this figure. Well, anyway, everyone, thank you very much for watching. I do hope you have enjoyed. If you have, feel free to tell me everything that you love about Deadpool and Wolverine down below. And... Tell me whether you prefer this figure or my other Deadpool and Wolverine Wolverine figure because I definitely prefer this one. But anyway, everyone, thank you very much for watching. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you later.